Alright, I've just beaten Gym Leader and I just remembered now that I left a honey tree that I put honey on and I think it should be shaking by now. And what's this? Apparently it is shaking. Wow, it should be a fairly high, and I haven't even healed my Pokemon. It should be a fairly high level Pokemon, or average level, so. Let's see what's in the tree. Wow, am I lucky? It's a Cherubi. And like I said, I, I wasn't sure it was if it was going to be a high or a low level, and it came out as level 9, so I didn't want to take the risk of knocking it out. Because Cherubi's a pretty rare Pokemon, and you can only get it in a tree anyways. So I'm going to take this battle a little slow. Lucky. All right, its HP is low. Now it's ready to catch. Gotcha! Yeah! Well, I've had a lot of catches lately. It's pretty good. I know it looks like a cherry. I, I would eat that thing too, but... <laughs> it grows into a fairly strong Pokemon. Um, if it was a female, I would call it cherry, but I don't know what to call it. Just leave it like that. Um, not now. Maybe some, sometime later I'll do it again. Maybe try to get a Munchlax or something else. We'll see. Anyhow, I need to heal my Pokemon now. And now, uh, let's see, Team Galactic. I need to get into that building, so I'll need someone with Cut. And I remember giving this Boonier a Cut. That's why I marked it. But who should I take off for the time being? Um, maybe I'll take Hulk Hogan. Since I only use my Grotto for battles anyways. Uh, okay. We're all set now. And ready to battle. Because I need to rescue that guy from the, the bike cycling building. Okay. Now let's head into this building. I need to cut this tree over here. I believe there are a couple items behind here. So let me get those first. And we find a TM46 thief right over here. Great. Alright, this is awesome. Finding a lot of stuff. Uh, what else? I don't think there should be anything else here. For the time being. But let's check behind there. There might be something else here. No, I guess not. Alright, so that's that. Um, for now, let's head into this building. I need to rescue that guy. And get me a bike. Wow, is that Looker disguised as a Team Galactic member? That is strange. 
Oh, that makes sense. He is a member of the International Police and Master of Disguise. An easy way to tell the stairs apart, huh? Okay. Ooh, let's watch TV here. We have an interesting hideout. <laughs> yeah, I won't fall asleep. I rarely do. Hmm. What are these things here? Of course one of them is a trap. Because they're standing there. However, I am looking to battle that again. I'll take them one by one. I bust through traps. That's why they're not a problem for me. Time to bust the move. That's right, nothing can stop my great power. I think that was a lady. Hmm, this is a dark poison. I need a stronger attack. This is where a tackle actually did come in handy. Surprisingly enough. Shoot. My next razor leaf misses. I'm taking a big bang. Goodbye, stunky. Too bad I can make better use of you. Cause I love dark type Pokemon. I feel sad that such weak trainers get to use them. Oh, this was a trap. You know, on second thought, it's not really a trap considering there was an item hiding behind all along. And I don't get it. Why didn't he fight me? I had to talk to him to personally fight him. Okay, poison fighting. I guess Razor Leaf will have to do. That's actually decent enough damage. I can get rid of it from there. Uh-oh. Okay, I got lucky there. Okay, now I know why it's not really good to single out with one Pokemon. With the fear status effects. I have to say paralysis has to be the best status effect in the entire game since it lasts forever and you won't get poisoned or anything else. And you can actually get away through the whole thing and just as long as your Pokemon can take hits. What? Well, some of them are rare. 